Hey, Colin, how you doing? Busy. <sighs> oh, uh, I just put my cigarette out outside. I, I thought we weren't smoking indoors. Do you mind if I... Yes, I do. Take a seat. <clears throat> so, uh, what's the problem? <sighs> Getting right into it. Listen, the environmental problems can't be ignored anymore. They're getting serious. The herbivores haven't migrated through this area in over a year, when they should be. I appreciate your concern, Jim. I really do. It's really commendable you care this much about your job. But if I were to tell any of my colleagues to shut down any operations because of some fussy, doomed animals, they'd have my head. Any disturbances to the environment can cause paradoxes. If this continues, no amount of money can fix anything because that money probably won't exist anymore anyway. There it is, the mighty P word. Look around us, Jim. It's a freaking miracle. Look, Jim, every time you use the word paradox, I just can't take it seriously anymore. Besides, all of our working evidence will be washed away by a flood. If you're not gonna listen to me about this, please listen to me about something more urgent. A Torbosaurus has taken interest in us. The carnivores usually leave us alone. We're too weird for them to understand. We're strange, we're alien. They're afraid of us, but that might be changing. With the herbivores gone, the carnivores either chased after them or stayed behind. And the ones left behind are starting to get hungry. So let me guess, they're hungry for us now. There's a possibility that's the case. Okay, Jim, has anybody gotten eaten yet? Well, you would know. You would have received a report directly from me to you. Don't fucking patronize me. Is that any way to talk to any of your other superiors? What are you gonna do, fire me? Not like any of us have any choice anyway. Go ahead. I'd fucking love if you fired me. Why am I here? You're here to prevent us from having cases like this. Thank you. This carnivore is one that stayed behind when the herbivores left. We don't know why it stayed around, whether it's just looking for food or it's curious, but it's here and it's circling my men's camps. So what am I supposed to do about it? Well, since you won't listen to me, about shutting down mining operations, I suggest you put your men on high alert. High alert? You're the one who requested this meeting. Wasting precious time to tell my soldiers to keep their eyes peeled? So? So why can't we just go out there and kill it? That would ruin the environment even more. God, Jim. You're hilarious. You're a goddamn broken record. Is it really a good idea to make this place exactly like home? What's going on, Will? One of my soldiers is just gone. And you checked his tracking chip, I assume? Yes, I did. It looks like it's been deactivated. You need to get your men out of there, now. Jim, it's company policy. We have to send a search party right now. Your men don't have the firepower to take something like that down. Then we'll just send more men. Oh, Jesus. Would it really be so hard to tranquilize it with a helicopter? That just sounds like more of a pain in the ass to me. I just got word there's something wrong with HQ. Are you safe? I have no idea what's going on. Just stay where you are. Jim, we gotta go to the bunker. Will is supposed to meet us here. He's supposed to escort us to the bunker. Last I checked, we had two working pairs of feet. Why don't we just use those? It's protocol. Do you think your buddy can protect us with his little pea shooter? Will! Hey, 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 hey. Do not give away our position while a multi-ton super predator is walking around. Will, are you there? Will? Wait! <sighs> Shit. Was that him? Did that little thing do this? I was just an infant. We have to get out of here. <sighs> oh man, this is all my fault. Shit. Hey, listen. I'm sorry. But we have to keep moving.
Jim, hey, you all right? You... I had no choice! <clears throat> Morning. Uh-huh. So everything that just happened, it's all squarely on you. I am fully aware, and I'm working on it right now. You're, you're working on it. I'm filled with confidence. So your team was out there fucking around with the wildlife. They had one job to do. They didn't do it. And here we are. Jim has warned me plenty enough. Uh, you know, cut the shit. I don't even need to hear it. He wants us to stop all mining operations. Is this feasible? So, listen very carefully to what I'm about to say to you. Jimbo and his team, they lack a fundamental grasp of brand value and loyalty, which makes them liabilities. It makes you a liability. Don't be a liability and fix the fuck up. Floods are coming. You gotta decide if you wanna get wet.